Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave and I am back with more reactions with an X. This time continuing on Marvel's What If series doing episode 4 and I'm pretty excited about it. I don't know about you guys, but I've been really enjoying most of the episodes. Obviously they go up and down in believability and tone, but really the quality seems to be consistent and I really love it. And I'm hoping you guys feel the same. Let me know what you guys have thought of the first three episodes so far in the comments below. Let me know which one's your favorite. Personally, I've got to say, I know it's just just because of Chadwick Boseman, but number two is my favorite. Also because it's kind of the wildest out of all of them. Uh, three is pretty crazy too, and, and somewhat more in ways believable than two. But I just love that, that kind of what if where everything changes. That's my favorite kind of what if story from Marvel. With that said, I want to take a second and give a special shout out to the patrons because without you guys, we wouldn't be able to do all this great content and I'd definitely be way less motivated. So thank you guys. I really appreciate you and you'll be able to access this uncut full video, full audio on the uh, Patreon. There'll be links as well as links with the password. So you should be able to get that pretty easily. And thank you guys again. Anybody interested in that, it's as low as a dollar a month and you too can become a patron and get all these fun little you know, early access, specific cuts, etc. Uh, I also want to take a second and give a shout out and a call to support the original content creator because if we don't support them, if we don't support Marvel, we're not going to continue getting these really well-made products, right? Like, generally speaking, most Marvel titles are good. Uh, they have stinkers just like everyone else, but... Overall, their formula seems to work, and they adapt it to new series and titles well. So with that said, I don't want to spend too much time harping on this. This one is supposed to be uh, what if Doctor Strange lost his heart instead of his hands, and I think this is going to lead into the more overarching what if stuff that goes on later, because we got about five more episodes, I think, if they said we had nine episodes. So we've got a lot to come still, and then Shang-Chi comes out this weekend too, so I'm, just, I'm hella going to be going and watch that, which sucks because I won't be able to do a real reaction to it, so maybe I'll just do a review. Yeah, it, it's not going to be available online, so, yeah. All right, well, let's get going, and uh, thanks for watching, as always, guys. I, I skipped the intro stuff this time. Follow me, and ponder the question. What if? So this is how he gets in the accident anyway. Well, that was the plan. Yeah, well, I would call that quite remarkable. <laughs> well, I would say the same about you. <laughs> I, I can't at all tell if that's actually uh, Benedict Cumberpatch at all. So this is one I'm not comfortable calling. Dad! What did he do and why? He was bolting. Okay. We're okay. Damn, strange. You're okay. And then they get hit from behind. Yeah, this one was a, a bit different. They, they made the premise so that they're closer in this, right? That they're actually having a relationship. Oh, no, 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 Christine. Come on, Christine. Oh, he has a different reason. In this universe, Stephen Strange didn't lose his hands. Oh. But his heart... Grief stricken, Strange sought answers across the world and in the mystic arts. To bargain. So it all Yet worked out the same. Game, Stephen Strange could not let go Except of the past. that. <laughs> I wonder if this Strange would be stronger I'm since he can control his hands. Now my favorite t shirt. Oh, wow. Then I'm going to have to take it back. Hmm. And there he goes. And this is why you should just listen to Wong. Nobody ever listens to Wong. Wow. Nice to remember. So he fucked up and didn't stop it, or did he purposely not do it, realizing, I don't understand. No, 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 not again. No! Christine! That's on you. What, what were you doing? I don't get it. He did nothing to change it. Isn't the bridge that way? 
taking a different route. Or is he stuck in a time okay. we'll be fine. where they keep killing her regardless? Okay, so then he's gonna get pissed off at time and fuck some it's shit up. I see what's happening. Let's stay in. We'll order pizza but the other one seemed like the same accident, so I don't know why he didn't do anything. Dress, okay? we'll go. I was gonna say, he's got the time so he can do this forever. So the only way he can be with her is to not be with her. That's how he's gotta do it. Nope, didn't work. Oh, he's gonna fuck some shit up. Like I said, this strange would change the whole universe to save that lady. Maybe he'll make a deal with Dormammu to break it. Dormammu could definitely break through time cycles and shit, or supposed to happen events, right? In fact, he's probably strong enough to raise the dead. Honestly. He's a madly powerful motherfucker. Why are you here? To help you. Not really. This is where it starts for you. With the death of Dr. Christine Palmer. So overwhelmed by loss, you will seek answers in the mystic arts. In me. Help me bring her back. I'm sorry, but I can't. No one can. Her death is an absolute point in time. Absolute. Unchangeable. Unmovable. No, don't tell Without James him that. Death, you would never have defeated Dormammu. Please do not do this, or I will be forced to stop you. You'd have to find me first. Yep. Once again, he would just keep moving. The time stone. <clears throat> Having only one of the infinity stones is enough to basically. Uh, Dodge, oh, move around, and get away from anyone who doesn't have an Infinity Stone. I'm looking for the Lost Library of Cagliostro. Clever. Hello? Does he have a sling ring? Anyone home? I wonder how this is gonna turn out. Ooh. Find a welcome. Please tell me you're not Cagliostro. <laughs> the name's Obang, librarian for the books of Cagliostro. Come hmm. this way, sorcerer. I would have picked it as Cagliostro. It's so. strange. Not any stranger than any other name. <laughs> they did another call to it. Oh my god. Wow, that does look dope. Lost books. Time manipulation. Bingo. See, like right there, he sounds just like Benedict Cumberbatch to me. So if it's not him, the, the an absolute point in time is immense. And if it's not him, the voice actor who's mimicking him is doing great. Doi. Aha! Gain the power through the absorption of other beings. Absorption. Here comes the evil. Here because I need to borrow your power. And grab. Do you mind sharing a tentacle or two? Please. It was nice. Yeah, beat the up. Is she worth the pain? A man does not suffer like this for his own glory. There's a really oh, moment of it. It's hard to root against him, right? There is a fine line between That's devotion and delusion. Right. Love can break more than your heart. It can shatter your mind. Uh huh. And in which book did you read that? <laughs> no book, Armani. Life. Armani. Mm. It's okay, they Sorcerer they Armani. If they won't surrender their power. Mm -hmm. I'll take it. I knew you would. Let's start small. Wow, that definitely has the evil look for sure going. Oh no, now he looks so cute and, and helpless. All right, what's next? Damn, son. He looks like the actual devil. Kerber, no, uh, uh Orberus? I forget uh, Kerberus's brother with the two-headed dog. Was that a nightmare? I can't recognize half these people. 
So if they're all comic Marvel stuff, that's crazy. But I, he's still beyond. That's why it's so crazy. The Watcher really is so powerful in so many ways, but never acts and never does anything. Said he always seems to be just this side of understandable. Who is it? Oh shit! If he's gotten this strong, everybody's fucked. Hello again, and goodbye. He just took the tentacles. Wow, that—that's a little more. I can, I can live with just the tentacles. Oh, and now they're just part of it. Oh. That's definitely going to do something to you, absorbing a ton of evil. Maybe they weren't all evil, but a ton of mystical power, probably some of them at least evil. I think we're only half a man, living half a life. Did she blast a part of Strange out it earlier? It was true. He wasn't alone. He wasn't even the only Doctor Strange in this universe. Well, I'm going to start Oh, because he broke out of the timeline. Join me before you do something. And his universe is starting to decay. Wow, jeez. They really do come up with some interesting new ways to make people just disappear into pieces. What was in that whiskey? Here's the other strange? Or the ancient one? Leostro? Nope, ancient one. Our time is running out. I fear the only sorcerer strong enough to stop Doctor Strange is you, Doctor Strange. There goes the echo. Okay, wait. So, the fabric of reality is breaking, and only you can stop it because you are causing it. Oh my god, he's disappearing. Honest, we've been through weirder, but do you want to stop him? I think he'll find you. He's found me. Oh, and he is much stronger. Great. Nope, it's not. Goodbye! I've been falling for 30 minutes! So that's what it looks like. No wonder Loki wasn't happy. Oh, and he put him in a summoning circle, so he's just trying to eat him. Wow, look at his shadow. When are you? Do not Even his cape looks evil. Old friend, for we are one and the same. Dare lie to me. I am you. Man, he's got to be so goddamn powerful. How many nights do we sit in the Sanctum Sanctorum, time stone in the palm of our hand, knowing we could go back, gathering the courage? I had the courage. Our powers are diluted, split between us. But once we become whole again, we can't save her. This, this is a suggestion, but he's really not going to take now. But you will see. The Ancient One warned us. If we save Christine, we destroy the world. Deranged. I will be whole again. No. Your marbles are long gone. I love the voice effect they're giving the world, Evil Strange. However, still stands a chance. You can't save her! She's dead! Oh. I'm honestly surprised that held up at all. That, that Strange should be so much stronger. I guess he said their powers are split, though. Said Stevens or good Doctor Strange should not be able to win this fight alone. Uh, he does have a totally different cape. It's like purple. That's pretty funny. The cape fight. Goodbye. Once again, he should be able to just straight tank most of what Doctor Strange has to throw at him. 
He's so strong after having been absorbing monsters. Yep, there's the watcher. That was cool. No, that was him. Shit. Interesting. Yeah, he's literally punching the spells off of him. Oh, yeah, this just should not be a fight he can win by himself. You can't do this. But we must. No. Yep. Last piece he needed. I think he's gonna break some shit. Damn, look at him now. That looks pretty cool there, but it was a little weird from far out. Wow, look at him. He is monstrous, monstrous. She ain't even gonna recognize him. It's me, Christine. Oh my god. Gonna hold up his reality? No, can't do it. You! You can stop this! Please! Fix this! The same way you fixed Christine. I was wrong. I. You were warned. I know, but the world! The world shouldn't. For my arrogance, I read about you, sensed your presence. You're a god. You can undo this. I'm not a god, and neither are you. Then punish me, not the world, not Christine. Honestly, if I could fix this, if I could punish you instead, I would. But I can't interfere. You, more than anyone else, should understand that meddling with time and events only leads to more destruction. No. No! I didn't mean for this to happen! New singularity or is it just done for? Oh, a world. No, a prism. And inside it, just him and her. Christine. I'm sorry. Steven. What did you do? No, 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 no. One life. This is the first one we get that is like a totally sad ending. I like it. I liked it. I really liked it. It was a really good sad what if. Because those are pretty common, honestly, where like, what if something and then it just has a sad ending. So like, this was really cool to see where it's like... And once again, it's really tough for me to, like, vote against him, where it's just like, yeah, I mean, I mean, if I was in position, fuck the world, too. <laughs> like, for him, with the exception that Wong is gone and the um, world is destroyed, which, it, I mean, I guess he cares about it because he keeps protecting it, but otherwise, like, he didn't really have many connections, right? Like, so for him, it's not necessarily too different. It just sucks that he failed and couldn't save her either, right? She's, like, his... The evil Doctor Strange, the only thing that mattered to him was that Christine was alive, right? To make her alive and fuck the rest of the world. So, this situation he's in is not all that different from the situation he was in before. This is kind of ironic, right? He still doesn't have her, right? Like, the, his goal did not, unfortunately, get achieved. I mean, his goal to get all super dumb powerful or whatever and break time did, but not to save the woman. So that's unfortunate, uh, but I mean, it's a very interesting take on it. And I, th I wonder if he's going to play more parts later. I definitely thought he was. And I'm super happy they just made Strange. I mean, Strange had to lose that fight, right? It was Strange versus himself with more power. 
<clears throat> so it just seemed like it, uh, it honestly seemed more drowned out than it ever should have been. <laughs> uh, the fight. But I do like it. I like the way that this was made. And honestly, I, I'm always surprised at how they bring new stuff, even in this little what if series, right? You have some that are heartbreaking and warming at the end, some that are just sad, some that are very inspiring like this could have been a maybe a better universe or maybe a worse universe or just a different universe so it's really great to see all that stuff with that said i want to give a big shout out to the patrons once again because without you guys we wouldn't be able to do this so thank you guys all so much as always you can find the link to the full uncut episode of this with all the audio on patreon with the password so yeah thank you guys as always support the original content creator because without them we just don't get more of this great stuff and if you enjoyed watching with us like comment maybe subscribe to see more or hit the bell to get notifications when we upload new videos and uh yeah you know if uh, you want to come and chat you can talk down in the comments but the easier way to get in touch with us is through our discord channel so we have that linked below if you want to come and chat it up about any of the series we watch we also do a bunch of gaming stuff there uh music there's a bunch of different like spots for people to hang out so we'd love to have you to come and hang out and uh yeah i'm axel grave this has been marvel's what if and we'll see you next time on reactions 